Hi guys and welcome back, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make a millionaire shortbread, let's begin. So to get started on the recipe, you'll want to grab yourself a food processor and make the shortbread base. Into the food processor, place in your plain flour, your sugar and butter and pulse everything together until it comes together. You're looking for it to go from the raw ingredients to breadcrumb and then take it that bit further until a dough starts to form but not comes together fully. Then grab yourself a 9 inch square cake tin and place all of the dough into it. And this is the more difficult part of spreading and leveling it out. It takes a little bit of time so make sure you set that aside. But once you've got it started to spread it out it should be fine. You want to try and get it as level as possible. Then bake that in the oven. So while that's baking in the oven you can go ahead and make your caramel layer. So grab yourself a saucepan and place in your sugar, your butter, your golden syrup and the condensed milk and just place on the hob over a medium low heat. This is important as there's a lot of sugar in this recipe and you don't want the caramel to burn as burnt caramel if you don't know is horrendous to get out of pans and smells absolutely terrible so don't do it. Then as I said place it on a medium low heat and just stir everything together and as it starts to melt you'll notice it goes from like the raw ingredients to looking like this but as you, in, you know as it starts to cook it will start to thicken up and colour and you can see the colour changing very quickly and it does thicken very quickly so be careful make sure you whisk continuously until the mixture is fully combined take your base out of the oven and pour the caramel layer directly on top of it and just spread and level that out as best as you possibly can allow it to cool down enough for you to be able to put it in the fridge so once you've got it cool enough place it into the fridge i like to leave mine for about half an hour to 45 minutes and by that time you're ready so then you can take your chocolate melt it in the microwave or over a double boiler and then just pour that on top of your set caramel base you can then go ahead and spread and level out the chocolate as best as you possibly can you do want to try and get an even coverage all over so just spread and level it out again as best as you possibly can and to not make this so basic i take some dollops of melted white chocolate and just place them all over the top randomly and then use a knife to squirt it all around just to add a bit of flair and make it stand out from the usual millionaire shortbread You can then also top it with some sprinkles. I found this mix in Aldi and it was a millionaire shortbread mix and I thought why not just sprinkle them all over the top and as you can tell the glitter adds a little bit of flair and it really does work well with that white chocolate as well. So if you're looking for something different check out your local Aldi for the sprinkles. Adds flavour, texture, why not? Once your bars have had some time in the fridge and the chocolate has firmed up, you can then go ahead and slice them up. But that's all for today, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more from me and I'll be back again soon, so join me then. In the meanwhile, don't forget to check out the description, there'll be a link to this recipe, a link to my blog and links to all my social medias. So don't forget to go and check me out on there. But that's all for today, I hope you enjoyed. Bye guys.